What's happening guys? My name is Rob Anderson and I'm the Product Training and Demonstrations Executive for Pioneer DJ. Today I'm here with DJKit.tv and we're going to be showing you through the STJ05s in white, as you can see behind me. Now, Pioneer have been famous for making speakers for years, however, the SDJ range is the first speakers developed by Pioneer DJ specifically for DJs, so they're for DJs and producers. They're designed so you can get an accurate flat frequency response for when you're producing music, but you can also use them for DJ monitoring as they've got an integrated two band EQ. We're going to get into the details now and actually see what they can do. So, looking at the front of the speakers, the SDJ 05s are packed with features that you wouldn't normally find on other monitor speakers, other studio style monitors. We've got Exclusive Pioneer construction on the 5 inch cone, magnetic shielding cone and also 2.5 inch soft dome tweeter. Ensuring really nice quality of sound, really true flat EQ response. However, the features that are exclusive to Pioneer on these units, one is the wired remote. So this is connected to speaker A which is in turn connected to speaker B. This allows you instant access to the power, so we can turn the speakers on and off, instant access to the volume, as well as an input selector. Now the SDJ05s come with four inputs, which I'm going to talk you through in a moment. So we can have up to four different setups running into these at any one time. You can have an iPod, you can have your DJ setup, as well as your studio setup, all running into the same set of speakers and instantly jump through inputs one, two, three and four. We've also got a mute button and we've also got an EQ button. So the EQ is great for if you're DJing on these speakers. You might have the EQ off for when you're using um, your studio setup, when you're actually producing music and then you can flick the EQ on which can be adjusted on the back to have a better bass response whilst you're DJing. Let's jump into the back of the monitors and you can see exactly what are the ins and outs. So yeah, jumping onto the back of the speakers, we can see we've got this large heat sink running across the back. This just ensures that the monitors can stay cool at all times in any prolonged studio sessions. We've also got four high quality inputs. So on most studio monitors you'd only expect to see one input. On the sdj 5s we've covered all bases. We've got XLR quarter inch jack inputs, we've got two phono connections, one and two, and the third input is also XLR, so ensuring really high quality output and really high quality referencing of your tracks. We've got an auto standby function, so if the speakers are, used, are left unused for any prolonged time, they'll switch themselves off to save energy. We've also got a level control. So monitor control in case you decide not to connect the wired remote. We've also got a really nice two band linear EQ. Like I mentioned earlier, this is great for if you want to use the speakers for just DJing or you listening to any other style of music. You can actually color the sound to how you like it. So you can see on this I've got a two decibel EQ boost on the low end giving more of a thump to my tracks if I'm just listening to normal music. We've also got connections for the control. So the wired remote will run into this DIN control and then the connection cable that connects speaker A to speaker B goes from out on here to in on speaker B. Yeah, the wired remote in slightly more action. This is a great tool, you know, just enabling you to not have to ever reach behind the monitors again. Once all your setups are running into the speakers, you can have this sit at the front of your desk and literally control it all from here. So we can turn the monitors on, scroll down to the, our selected input, in this case input 3, which is the XLR input, turn the volume up. Now in this case, we're not producing, so we don't need a flat EQ response. I'm going to turn the EQ on as well. Turn the EQ on for a slightly better bass response, more thumb to our music. Okay, so 
that's the SDJ 05s in white. Packed full of features that you wouldn't necessarily find on other studio monitors, but maintaining a really high quality, pioneer exclusive sound output. Retailing at 499 exact same price as the SDJ 05s in black, but with the slick white finish. These will be available mid-November from DJKit.com.